Hey everyone, this is my Patreon proud reaction to the 65th episode of Hikaru no Go. Last episode we had a bit of a side quest kind of episode, a flashback. Just giving us a chance to see Sai again, which I do appreciate. So what will we do with this episode? Another flashback episode or will we continue with the plot and see how Hikaru continues to deal with his current situation? I guess we'll see. So we can do it. 3, 2, 1, play. Just... Hikaru and Akira. It'll happen. Eventually. <laughs> <sighs> it's a bit unfortunate that that Akira won't get a rematch with Sai himself, but he will be able to face Hikaru, which is, you know, next best thing. Sassive shirt. Yeah, this is from last, well, the episode before last episode. Isumi no go. The spin off we need. Are we really going to get, get Isumi focus? Half an hour. Yeah, I kind of thought so. Apparently not. I know things get a little bit sad with these to me, but it's good to see he's moving forward. <laughs> Fair enough. Come on, son. So we're just gonna focus on other characters for a while to give Hikaru a chance to get back into things. Uh, peculiar. My bad. I mean, what do you say to that? There's some good Go players out there. Get some food. Yeah, I can tell.
Okay, just hang in there. Uh, do your best. Oh, here's Sicardo. Like that. The one rock that's drawn differently so it can be animated. Gotta be careful for those stones. Sigh. You're not Sai. Why'd you get a house up like that? I'm playing with a rock in the park. What are you doing? Think a pro go player has better things to do than that? Yeah, we want to know what's up. It's going to be hard to explain. Well, you wouldn't really believe him if he told you the full story. Poor Rock, he did nothing wrong. <laughs> oh yeah, that... Ah, uh, Hikaru. Dang. And yeah, you're just sitting here in a park playing with rocks. Yeah. Yeah. I don't think Isumi would be happy about that at all. <laughs> uh, what? The heck? <laughs> Can't play imaginary go. <laughs> oh no, go stop playing go on my head. It won't stop. I didn't mean to respond to his imaginary move. Uh, but yeah, go. You, hey, Carter, you don't actually not care about Go anymore. You just, you're just depressed, basically. Lost focus, sight of your goals. You'll get back into it. Of course, you would. Uh, <laughs> the important things. Zhao, Zhao. Zhang Guo Go Institute. I really cannot just pronounce Chinese to save my life. Beijing, okay, so that's where we are. It's curious. I mean, China's a big place, you know. Wow. One of the chosen pros. Very determined. Yeah, if you're a pro, that's all that matters.
I think they're saying Cho. But of course, the Japanese people try to pronounce Chinese names, so. I can understand that. So just do better this time. What? Why? Well, I guess we're going there too. Not a bad idea. Okay. What do you think, Isumi? It's your choice. Yeah, what do you want to do? It definitely is. Of course. Yeah, these people, they look pretty serious. The, the ping? What? It does look a little bit like why, doesn't it? Uh. <laughs> that was a little bit embarrassing. Yeah. It's surprising how many of these Chinese people speak Japanese. No, he's trying, but... Coming to Pro didn't go so well for him. What? Whoa! Okay, uh, why? Okay, that's what he's showing. I don't know, we never looked at Waya's belly. That really does look a lot like Waya, like, scarily similar. Weird child. Yeah, how old was he, like eight? Sure. Yeah, it's plenty of time. <laughs> I hope so. I want to see Yusumi succeed in some regard. Hey, Waya 2.0. How is that not Waya? Yeah, but we gotta become friends with Mini Waya. course. <laughs> Le Ping.
Oh boy, I wasn't paying the, the like a fake name in Mulan movie, Disney movie. Because that takes place in China, so. Yeah, I can believe Ping is a Chinese name. Of course, he's Lei Ping. I don't know if that's all one name or... I don't know. I don't really don't know how Chinese names work. I literally know nothing about China. Like, except they have a Great Wall, I, I guess. That's where Hong Kong is. And they use kanji, which Japan got their kanji from them. That's about it. Yeah, it seems to, seems to be his thing. Yes, until you said that. Yeah, well, you're just a mini YS, so take that. <laughs> How dare mini YS laugh at me? Who does he think he is? A little bit frustrated there, you see me? Getting mocked by a smaller version of your friend in, in a different country. You just get on their level. Yeah, but it, it, I mean, what you get out of it really depends on you. You really can be kind of a depressing character sometimes, you know, Yusumi. Okay, I mean, why not? Okay. Should be fun. We got the, we got the music playing that tells us this is an important match. Everyone, everyone here is pretty good. Wow, a nine don, really, dang. Resign, yeah. Why did you not see that? Yeah, that's what he said. Okay, hopefully you learned something from that, I guess. Uh, that's not many wire. Do you want to go check up on him? Young, high... Kind of a cool name. A double. Oh, really? Just met him, but, uh... Kind of funny to be watching a Japanese anime where a Japanese person is referred to as a foreigner. <laughs> I know, right? That would be pretty important.
I mean, yeah, if I was him and a Japanese guy came over, I'd ask him about his favorite anime and whatnot. So, yeah, I'd probably, be, I'd probably do some, handle that similarly. My go supports me. Gotta believe in the heart of the go, I guess. Yeah, why are the real one? Hikaru and Oya. Come on, Isumi, just, just... Yeah, I don't know. Isumi definitely has some confidence issues. Affected his gameplay. I don't know what to say to him, honestly. Like... I'm not a pro at anything, so there's just kind of a limit to how much I can really empathize with some of these problems. Or give any kind of advice or anything, so. All I can really say is I hope you get past it, whatever your hang up here is. It's still a bit of a weird song here. Music is my thing. Is my heart. I mean, it's those random English sentences that pop up like that. Oof. Tournaments, okay. That was an elderly man. Cool. Yeah, 2002 was just so long ago. Unfortunately, they lost. Okay. That was the 65th episode of Hikaru No Go. And as the title said, you know, Yusumi No Go. The focus was mostly on him. We got a little bit of Hikaru stuff, just enough to remind you that he still exists, you know? But the focus was really on Isume and his adventures in China. And I'm not really sure how much we really have to say on that. It's just, he's obviously been struggling for a while. He's not hes not a bad Go player. Like, he's good. He's taken games off of you know, really good people. But just, uh, there's just something there that's just... I don't know. I don't really don't know what his issue is. I can't really speculate too much. Like, I don't fully understand what his problem is. I'm sure that's probably just my fault, but still. So I can't really say a lot on that. But he's clearly makes these mistakes he shouldn't be making, resigning early in games that he could still continue with, being more aggressive than he should. So it, it, it's kind of stem. All I can think of is just some kind of lack of confidence, I guess. But I don't know what we do about that. Like, and, you know... It's it's clear that he has lack of confidence. I mean, the whole discussion there, well, his monologue when he was looking at all the Chinese pros that are there and they're all so young and so good, and he just feels out of place, like he doesn't belong here. So like, there's clearly some confidence issues. I'm sure about that much at least. But just I don't know. He may just just I can't even give advice. Like I don't know what to even say. Like if he was my friend right next to me, I don't know what I would say to help him. Like you can't just say. Have confidence, do your best, and then things are better. It just doesn't doesn't work that way. It's like when you, it's like when if somebody's you know really shy or whatever, and you tell them just go be social. Like it doesn't doesn't work that way. It helps literally no one to say that. 
So all I can say is I hope things look up for Yusumi and he gets over whatever his hang-up is here and starts to, you know, play as best as he can, learn some valuable stuff from this, maybe make some friends, maybe make better friends with Mini Waya. And I still don't quite understand that. Like, that was a weird thing to have a Mini Waya in the show. Like, I, I don't know what the point of that was. To just make it feel a little bit more at home for him, I guess. I don't... I don't know, it was kind of a weird kid too. Like showing his belly button as a way of proving his identity, I don't know. But yeah, just hopefully things look up for me in the future. So. Thank you for watching, and a special thanks to Snokey for supporting the channel. If you enjoyed this video, I hope you consider clicking the like button and leaving a comment, because that's a great and easy way to let me know that people want more. If you want to do something big to help the channel, you can support me on Patreon and get nice benefits like early access to certain videos. See you next time.